What's up guys, Sehaman back with another review. Today we're taking a look at the brand new, super hard to find, NECA Toys Target exclusive based off of the animated series. We have Casey Jones and versus the Foot Soldier Slashed. I love how they change the colors on the title there. So you have the... Uh box packaging similar to all the other animated ones so you have casey jones animated here and the foot soldier we can see cut in half you have the figures there uh, the side of the packaging shows you the foot soldier the other side shows you casey jones and then on the back you have all the figures available i need april o'neill and the foot soldier I already have bebop and rock steady uh, and I'm, i definitely definitely need leatherhead and slash there's a little bit of a read up right there if you want to read it up just feel free uh just pause it right there and there is an image of both figures here there is the bottom of the packaging the other side the top all that good stuff let's open this up and take a close look and we're going to see if this is a pickup or a pass pick up if you can find it so the foot soldier came this set comes with a lot of accessories first of all these are all of the hands uh not all of them but some of the hands that the foot soldier does come with so you can see the difference hand different hands there um he also comes with other hands to hold on to the weapons that he does come with so you have these here so i took these out so just to display some of the weapons and then he also comes with a little communicator and then what's awesome is you got rock steady on there look at him that's so funny. So we have this little communicator here, which is awesome. Um, they also do come with two ninja stars. I believe these are from the foot soldier. But yeah, they got two ninja stars. And then we also have a weapon here, like a little blaster. So you can see, does this actually go back? No, it doesn't. So look at the detailing on that. This is super cool. So you got that there. And then we'll go ahead and bring out the foot soldier. And here he is. And you can, again, you can see he slashed. I like how they did this. So you can see all the mechanics inside. Get the detailing on there. You can see some of the wiring. So just be careful with this because you can probably break this. I think the only thing that is holding this together is this red wire right there. That is the only thing. But if you wanted, like really wanted, a chopped in half foot soldier, you can just break it off. The foot soldier itself looks to be similar to all the previous ones that we've gotten. I love the design on the foot soldiers. You got the foot right up top. It's all sculpted in. You have the wrist guards, forearms, whatever you want to call it. And then there is the loincloth right here, which is a soft rubber material. And there is the bottom here. You can see the feet. It does have peg holes. Uh, still similar or still the same articulation. But let me go ahead and pop off the hand here. See how easy I can do that. All right. It wasn't no problem at all. Let's go ahead and find one that's going to hold on to his weapon. We'll bend at the elbow there. And then where did I leave that? All right. So we'll go ahead and open the hand a bit. And then... Because I want to display him like he's just in battle with Casey Jones. So that is pretty cool. There is the foot soldier. Again, if you have one foot soldier, you pretty much know what you're getting. But this is obviously a different one from the other ones because he is slashed in half. Okay, so as far as Casey Jones, now that way he goes, I'll show you some of the accessories he comes with. First of all, you have his little sack here. Oh my god. Leave your jokes down below. But this is where you're going to keep his weapons. It's like a soft rubber material. It's got some sculpting on there, some nice detailing. So you can put all his weapons in here. He does come with a baseball bat. That is pretty cool. He comes with... A, oh, I forgot to mention. Foot Soldier also has another weapon here too. I forgot to show this one off. So you have the scope there. So he does come with this one as well. Um, but he also comes with a hockey stick. There you go. This is pretty awesome. I love the way it looks. He This one, I don't know what this is. What is this guy? Like a, some kind of a bat, but that has like wiring around it. I don't know. You guys can let me know the name of this one there. So it does have that. Actually, you know what? This is a hockey stick, right? But you got these two right there. He's come. He got. He has a lot of weapons here. And I. Oh, he also comes with like a hammer. Look at this thing. It's big old one here. That is pretty awesome. He's got that. And then you get some different. Let me find all the hands here that he does come with. You get a different amount of interchangeable hands. So I'm going to need this one to hold on to the weapon. And then I like this one here. I like that he comes with a thumbs up. That's pretty cool. And then he has a pointing finger. I might use this one, the pointing finger and the one where he can hold on to a weapon. The, now he does come with close fists. So you can see that there. And then you have Casey Jones. Shit. Must be gangsters on their way to a big heist. Yeah. Holy guacamole. Look at the mask on him. That is awesome. I love the way this looks. It looks like it's straight out of the animated series. You have the hair. You got the straps from the mask. The ripped shirt, totally 80s, right? Total, totally 80s, early 90s. You have the shoulder pad. 
there and the, the strap that goes all the way around. Is it a separate piece? Yeah, it looks to be a separate piece. You have his little jogger pants. Look at this. They got rips on them. Little rips at the bottom. He uses uh, some kind of a lace to tie the bottoms. And then you got his boots, his green boots. I love the shading too. So these are pretty cool. What's he, what, these aren't laces. What's he, he's got little straps there. You got peg holes at the bottom of the feet. And then again, close fist, the wraps around the wrist. And then again, you can see some of the shading on the outfit and in the arms. You can see his little little V shape there. Drawstring from the jean or from the sweatpants. So pretty cool. Casey Jones is definitely awesome. We'll go over the articulation really quick. The head sculpt can rotate. Uh, it doesn't really go up and down a whole lot. I love the mask. They need to make an animated version of the mask. Uh, the arms do go in and out, forward, or actually rotation in the upper arms. He's double jointed. He's got double jointed elbows. That's pretty awesome. The hand can rotate. Also, hands a hinge. What else do we got? Rotation at the waist. It's like belly button. Ab crunch. He looks like he has also upper rotation as well. The legs go in and out, forward and back. These are double jointed knees. Yep, he's got double jointed knees. Upper leg rotation. The foot goes up and down. Does it have the ankle pivot? I don't know. I don't want to ro rotate it the whole lot. I don't want to break this guy. But he's got some pretty good range of motion. So let's go ahead and strap him on with all of his accessories. All right, guys, so what you want to do to attach this to the, the, the characters, to the body of the figure, you don't put it on with the head sculpt on. I just almost made that mistake and almost ripped this. You can see that right there. Pop the head off. I don't know why I didn't think that at first. It pops off very easy. And then look at that. He looks awesome. All right, so here we have Casey Jones holding on to the baseball bat, and it, he's holding on to it very well. And then I have him displayed with the pointer finger. That's how I'm going to definitely display him with this hand at least. But uh, with this uh, bat, he holds on to it very good. I got a very nice grip to it. Let's see how he looks with the uh, the hammer. So he holds on to that. I'm still debating what I'm going to have him hold on to. So we got that one. And then we have the hockey stick. Yep, he holds on to that really good too. I mean, you can have him hold on to uh both with you know with both hands onto a weapon and you have this one here so uh yeah i like how this one looks i might go with this one here right here i have all of his weapons in his bag and this is going to be the way i display casey jones so let's go ahead and do a comparison with the vintage casey jones versus the newer version of casey jones got the similar style the paint apps are obviously a lot different and the detailing is a lot different i mean especially with the back, I mean, the, the the bag is obviously different. They're all one color, but it's still really cool to have the vintage figure and the new figure side by side, just to give it a little bit of a comparison. This is awesome. And there you go, guys. There is my review today. We're taking a look at the brand new NECA Toys Target exclusive Casey Jones versus Foot Soldier, Soldier Slash. Say that five times fast. Based off of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles animated series. Now, this was not easy to find, and it's not going to be easy to find for you guys, unfortunately. But keep on hunting. Don't give in to the scalpers. I love this set. I love the Casey Jones. The Foot Soldier is awesome. I love that they gave us a different version of him. I mean, Slash. I can't wait for the ultimate foot soldier the one that's i think it's supposed to be a two pack or an, just a one figure with a bunch of different accessories you can army build that too uh, but i'm really excited to see what else they get you know they give us they already announced the muck man the gecko the vernon and a bunch of other figures so i'm really happy for this i just hope that these figures become easier to find let's keep our fingers crossed but let me know in the comments below is it a pickup is it a pass and if so if you already picked the set up let me know what you think are you still looking for it what do you think, guys? Thumbs up the video. Stay tuned for the Casey Jones and Raft 2-pack review. We'll see you soon. Later. Don't believe. Awesome. Let's see. Who's gonna